Hello everyone. Let's talk about living relationships, shall we? It's like marriage with a try before you by option. You know, a living relationship is a lot like making a sandwich. You start with two slices of bread, and by the end of the week, you're just trying to figure out how to put the jelly back in the jar. But honestly, there's something oddly beautiful about sharing a space with someone you love. It's like a never-ending sleepover with someone who has seen you at your best and worst, usually within the same hour. One of the first things you discover in a live-in relationship is that your partner has some truly fascinating habits. Like leaving empty cereal boxes in the cupboard as if they're artifacts from some ancient cereal civilization. Or the way they insist on using every dish in the kitchen to cook a single meal. It's like they're trying to win a most dishes used in a single cooking session award. And then there's the great toilet paper debate. Over or under? It's a question that can spark a heated argument that rivals any political debate. I mean, who knew that the direction you hang toilet paper would become a relationship deal breaker? But let's not forget about the closet wars. You start off with equal space, and somehow, over time, their clothes start taking over like they're on a mission to annex your side of the closet. It's like a hostile fashion takeover. But here's the thing, despite the quirks and the occasional disagreements over whose turn it is to do the dishes, there's something incredibly special about waking up next to someone you love every day. It's like having a built-in partner for midnight snack raids and impromptu dance parties in the living room. So, here's to live in relationships, my friends. It's like a never-ending sitcom with plot twists, laughter, and the occasional cliffhanger. And remember, it's not about finding the perfect person, it's about finding the perfect person you can be imperfect with. Thank you, and good night.